out your anybody falling out with you, feel me, over your, you know, your success that you having right now? Man, I've been doing a lot of growing apart the mm. past few years, and this year has been like another one of those like heavy dumps where you just gotta like, you know, it's a tree growing and branches growing every direction. You feel me? So I, I've been doing a whole lot of it this year. Mm. Yeah. The even with that, it's still kind of some damn. You know, it's kind of like. You gotta tell yourself down for now, outgrow this nigga. Fuck. <laughs> like, but she, you got to. Like, yeah, you got to. Though. You tell yourself, like, yeah. damn. You looking at a nigga, you got like, nigga, I'm about to outgrow you. I don't look at it like that. I just know I'm gonna outgrow you. I'm no. looking at it like that. No, I've told you two, three sometimes times. You, you, sometimes you, you feel it coming. Like, you 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 know, you know, things like just consistently keep aligning for it, like, to happen. And sometimes we just fight it. Like, it'd be supposed to happen Facts. way Facts. sooner, but right, you'll yeah. keep turning Still your head. Long, you feel yeah. me? Yeah, but it's sure. like, sometimes it, it, it was always... You know, you don't always have to wait until life for some shit. You know, sometimes you could get ahead of it. Like, you know, if you can go out in your journey and pull all the logs out the road so you don't trip. Yeah. You know, it'll, it'll, it'll help you out. But that's like shit that I'm I'm just now learning myself, <laughs> you know, to where it's like that shit just happened. It just it's that's life. Fetch. Like imagine having the same teacher all through school. You feel me like that shit? Damn. It ain't it. You feel yeah, me? It's yeah, like it's you're going to, you got, you get different friend group, different teachers di- all throughout your life. You feel me? So it's, it's like natural. It's inevitable. Yeah, it is inevitable. But it's also like, damn. Yeah, yeah. It still it got that damn moment. It, on. it stain, always got that stain. damn moment. Yeah. It's always got that damn moment. Like, nigga, we did some shit together. Like, I saw yep. some Target with you, nigga. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, and you know, you, you know what's what crazy? Mean? That's like, that's the thing that you always have to keep in mind when you get into them states of like, fuck that nigga. You yeah. feel me? You always have to remember like, nah, we started in Target. And, and that love mm. that was in Target, it's like, that never go away when it's like real. What? You feel me? Yeah, I mean, that, you, you, you definitely got to keep the moments. Sometimes I, I be, I've be i been doing that lately too. Because I, I, be, I be dealing with, uh, I'm just right off, right off the bat, I'm like, nigga, fuck everybody. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah, what I mean. And yeah. You can't do that shit. You feel me? You can't leave with your emotion like that. And I, I know I got. I know I, I've been working on it. I've been working on it lately. But as soon as I get mad, I fuck it. Just fuck everybody. But then I go back to like, damn, I can't say that because we did X, Y, and Z over there. You know what I mean? Like I, I almost died. Yeah, yeah. Nigga, help me. Yeah, I, you know I mean, but yeah, I mean, still growing apart thing. I mean, I think it's more so like, you know what? We stay over there. I stay over there. But I ain't gonna say. You know what I mean? Right. I'll fuck you for life. And celebrate the people around you. You know what I mean? Like, it's, sometimes it becomes selfish, you know what I mean, to be worried about somebody that you got to separate from when you got people right beside you that's mobbing for you and going crazy. And, yeah. You know what I mean? Y'all creating new memories and, you know what I mean? All that. Like, mm. you know what I mean? Like, sometimes you can look at it like that and snap out of it, you know? I mean, the niggas around me, man, they lit. You know what I mean? We lit. Right. You know it always, I mean? it always, like, for me, it always be like, <clears throat> like, you know you got to move forward, but it have an effect on you because, like, when your surroundings start to change, you start to question if you changing too, right? And sometimes that shit don't, you don't always feel good about that. You feel me? But right, it's like, right. you got to grow. Yeah, right. <laughs> you got to grow. It's uncomfortable. Right? It's uncomfortable. Yeah, your surroundings growing is like... At first, it is uncomfortable. Like, yeah, am I getting bougie? <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what I for mean? Real. Like, <laughs> for real. For real. It's kind of like, damn, I don't want nigga to judge me. Yeah. Because I'm getting bougie, but I don't even think it's that. It's just like, okay, my little taste level going up a little bit. Yeah. I'm going to different little restaurants. <laughs> nigga, yeah. and you still don't know what you want. Yeah. I'm out for a and you know you should never feel bad imagine y'all you you stand in the same hotel as somebody and y'all both get on the elevator and y'all put y'all floors in and his shit say five and your shit say 20 you know it's like you just know we together from zero to five and then you got to get off <laughs> yeah. my shit going to 20 Mm. And that that it ain't Damn. even nothing to fight over. It just is what it is. Damn. I mean, at, at, musicians always ask this to even rappers, just rappers and artists in general. Like, how do you deal with being an artist in a relationship? 
like like your girlfriend, your like girlfriend. your shorty type shit? Yeah, your girlfriend. Oh, man. Or your wife or fiance or she looking. If you don't got nobody, like, really, if you don't have nobody in your corner, like, like, if you really don't have nobody in your corner, and she's not, like, your secret weapon, or, you know what I mean? She's not somebody that's really, really, y'all not, like, best friends first, it ain't gonna never work. It's not mm-hmm. gonna work. She gonna, she gonna always hate on you. She only can hold on for so long. She only can hold on for so long. Straight up. She Your can only girl hates you and that shit is crazy. It's, it's over with. It's over with. You can forget it. Christmas canceled. Now you going to work pissed off. You know what I mean? Mm. And now you can't be the best you. You know she gonna, I mean? Cause she gonna press your buttons. Yeah, it start from home. Fuck your whole day. You know what I mean? You might be looking for a pair of socks. You feel me? And and, and it gets spunky after that. You know what I mean? Now you stumbling out the house and you ain't saucy. As saucy as you thought you was gonna be when you woke up. Mm. You know what I mean? That shit start from the crib. You a trash rapper. <laughs> ah, <laughs> I hope they throw something at your ass. Nigga, fuck you. I hope you don't sell out, nigga. <laughs> Damn, I hope you don't sell out. It's crazy. They be trying to hit a nigga. <laughs> God damn. I, I, I might think that's the hardest thing as far as being an artist. I think being in a relationship and the other, the other party really don't know what's going on if y'all ain't on the same accord. 